Stage six. Six six. Just kidding. I can. <laughs> oh, what the hell am I saying? I'll, I'll talk about whatever I want. That's not a serious subject. Anyway, welcome back from all this play. Let's get dragon. If my controller will cooperate, I'm trying to show the fact that it is. Uh, cooperate with me, controller. Thank you. Uh, there's a power core up there. That's pretty useless at this point because at I just should have made mention of this in the start of the LP. If you complete a stage, your monsters will be fully restored to full health the same as you. But if there's any stage, I can stress enough to watch your pace, it is this one. As there are a ton of explosives throughout the stage that will harm you if they explode. There is also these bots that will explode, their explosions will hurt you. It may not look like it, but they will. So, be extremely cautious. Keep your distance when fighting them off, because you will take heavy damage unless you keep your distance. There's a six, um, lightning upgrade, by the way. That's kind of the whole reason why I went down here in the first place. This isn't the proper route. This first stage is kind of like a ma like, like a little maze of sports, where your first time through, you may not know where you're around, but, and yeah, it can be really, really annoying, especially with all these enemies roaming about, um, not knowing that those um, bombs will hurt you if you shoot them or if you so much as touch them because they will be if you touch them. Yeah. If you don't know you're around, you will take heavy. I can't I, 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 I get the idea of this point. So yeah, I, I, damn it! I I know every nook and cranny of this game. There's, I still take I'm still taking heavy damage because I suck at this stage. No two ways around it. I just suck. Okay, I'm gonna take this right here. Okay. Now, provide that you can survive the onslaught. There is it. There is. Oh my god, what is wrong with my speed? There is indeed something very special for you. Okay. Over. Here, actually. Give that. Go through here, hidden wall. Hidden pathway. Yeah. You hear that, Mr. Marvelous Wii? Yeah. You're not the first game to implement hidden passages through walls, ha! Okay, enough for in that game's face. You know I love the game. There's a continue up there. Should you make it through the onslaught? And keep getting that continue. You don't have to worry about getting a game over. Because you can keep on getting that continue. And yeah, you just have infinite tries. <laughs> so yeah. I'm going up through here. But I love just how everything is angled, you know, like this whole space structure of sorts. This, I don't know, it just looks like something that would be cracking down. Ah, damn it. Um, I was trying to go up there to, to uh, kind of prove that there's nothing up there. Nothing is worth the effort. But, yeah. Remember that pace control thing I talked about? This is why. For literally every inch you take, every inch you step, an enemy will spawn. If you don't watch your pace, you will be flooded with enemies. Lee, there's a. I get there is. I know way too much about this game. <laughs> yeah. To the point where. You can pretty much call what's in any iron slot. Like, this is gonna contain a potion. Yeah, case in point, I know way too much about this game. God, I put my cat in no hotel. Oh, it's not entirely true, I mean. It's cool. I don't wanna go through that. Uh, I don't wanna explain that. Like, that's, uh, that's something I'd rather forget. It's just pretty serious from the topic all the other. Just destroy you. You're lightning. There we go. 
Okay, now this right here. Here's our barrier and our apostle stage. This weird looking thing and it's gun. Now I'd recommend either the um ball of fire or the um, Thunder Raven. The ball of fire, as it is a good counter act a counter um counter partner for is it, it it's really good for absorbing some of the shots that you may not be able to dodge. But what this guy does is typically fight one of the circles and spawn those guns if you destroy them. I highly recommend that you do destroy them. Because if you don't, yeah. This this guy also has some shots that he'll fire from his fingertip. Why his finger counts as a gun, I don't get it. But you also fire three shots, but you'll fire them at a wide angle. Making them a little tougher to avoid. So yeah. Actually for the reason I'm gonna use uh, the um Thunder Raven. That reason there. It is the Thunder Raven reason being is it is because of its green nuke attributes, it's very helpful for taking out some of the guns. Also, keep on the move for it uh, for that thing does spawn at random points. Or it seems to spawn at random points in the um uh, arena. You also kinda wanna be careful as it is sort of easy to lose your thunder raven here. I've had previous playthroughs where I that where the Thunder Raven took so much damage where it ended up dying. So yeah, you wanna keep that in mind. Get that out of the way. Both the fact that those um Engines, I guess you could say, are constantly just moving at an alarmingly fast pace in this arena. It's a little detail that is really, really clever. Well, there's what a death looks like. I'll be right back. Uh, I can't believe I died to that. Okay, I guess it would be a crime if I didn't get it so much, if I didn't get so much over here. It's an improper path, but there are, I guess, some stuff over here. I never really been. Oh, I was wrong. I was wrong. There is the lightning upgrade here. Ah, uh, I was wrong. Sorry, guys. But yeah, those watching this video, now you know. I honestly, I honestly. Thought I knew every nook and cranny of this game? No! I did not know that lightning upgrade was there to be frank. Uh, I'm calling myself out of my bullshit. Uh, sorry if I laid you guys astray. Great, right, now you guys know that was not there. And this invisibility as well. Like, honestly, I couldn't pick. I couldn't pick a um, better stage to recommend this invisibility for. If you want to keep the game, this area, I guess, get your way back. Other than that, watch your face. Unfortunately, this isn't right. You're supposed to go through here. Duh! I'll get on my ass. I'm back and stronger than before! Ha <laughs> ha! I bet you were counting on me not finding that lightning of free. Yep, yeah, it you were. Alright, I initially have my Thunder Raven out this time. Purely to um, help deal with those guns that he will spawn. Or, yeah, to help deal with those um, guns. I'm bringing the thunder! <laughs> wow, I'm kinda. Pollocked. I didn't use that pun before. <laughs> oh yes, one pun leads to another. <laughs> yeah, you know, thunder, thunder raven. Talk. 
I'm using lightning as my main attack. Yeah, you, you gotta get it. No, I better check a Raven on Thunder Raven, I don't want her to die. Wait. I don't really believe there are any, um, life orbs beyond this point, so, yeah. You want to be especially careful not to let any party members die. Okay, I've got my guns here. And our inventory for the gun. Okay, thank Okay. Thank the mighty holy bagels. I think the joke a little far. I, I want to. I'm not gonna joke falls for it. Pretty much. Of course, I retreated as a joke. Here's the thing, the game being left right in the hearts. Anyway, we have done it! But it's not over yet. And yeah, there's nothing up here, so don't even bother. <laughs> I don't even know why I did that in the first place. But yeah. Yeah, go ahead and take down these guys here. Um, there's really not much you need to worry about in going through here. And just those guys that'll show up. And there's only like what two of them. So yeah, there's really nothing you can worry about. Just up from here. That's the end of stage six. Six. Six, six. Okay, I had to do that one last time. And... Yep. That ominous atmosphere above the clouds. Lightning storms are rampant. On that floating isle lies the enemy base. Also fans of this bird. Sickos, I guess. Maybe we'll storm that fortress next time. Right, let's play this to Dragoon. See you guys then.